Hey there, we're back with another new blog post this week in our RSG Life series. And this one is all about community. Specifically, it's about how to make new friends as an adult because if you're like us, that's kind of hard and awkward, right? So Justin's got some tips in the blog post and he's going to share a little bit more. Yeah, so this one's kind of near and dear to my heart because it's something I really struggle with. I don't have a big circle of friends and moving over here, it's been hard to kind of make new friends as an adult. So in the post, I talk about kind of getting over yourself and um, letting go of, of fear of judgment or worrying about people because I think that's been big for me is um, just forgetting about uh, what people think about you, I think, is kind of one of my fears as being kind of shy and a little more introverted. Um, so that's like the, that's probably the number one thing for me. But if you read the blog post, you'll you'll read all about that. But some specific things that I mention in there that are helpful to meet new people is are things that I'm trying out. So some are getting active. So one way to meet new people is to join a new gym or start taking exercise classes or spin classes or things like that. Somewhere that you can go regularly, you'll see some of the same people kind of break the ice. Um, it's easier to, to kind of meet new people that way because you see them pretty regularly. Uh, another option is to look on meetups. So meetup.com has a lot of kind of local activities and you can kind of filter it by interest and all you have to do is kind of sign up for these activities and and show up basically um, another one is volunteering so finding something you're interested in uh, this has been good for me I volunteer to coach like youth flag football with a friend of mine uh, so you meet a lot of local parents and get to know the kids and it's fun or if you volunteer somewhere else, anything you're interested in, you're gonna always be meeting new people that way. Um, and then the last one, which I'm not very good at, but Erica's uh, good at, is kind of utilizing social media. So you might have a group of connections that you're just connected to on social media, but they might be in the same town as you and you might be able to meet up with them for coffee or lunch or whatever just to kind of break the ice and meet some new people. So those are my tips. Go out and do it. <laughs>